Lou with another episode of My Car Story and today we're in Carlisle, Pennsylvania at the Carlisle events, the Chrysler Nationals. Look in the description of this video and you can see all the Chrysler events and the great car shows they have. I'm with Don Motes. Don has an amazing factory drag car. Don, what year make and model is this one? This is a 1966 Plymouth Belvedere 1. It was Lee Smith's wacky wagon. Let's take a look at it. And this one, well, it has the 426 Hemi. We're getting photo bombed on it right now as we go to video. <laughs> so that's gonna happen. Well, you don't get to see this car too often, let alone ever. So how long have you had it, Don? <clears throat> had it seven years now. Let's, uh, let's pop the, uh, while you pop the hood, I'll take a look at the side of it if you would. We've got the HP2. Let me show you the paint job on this. As you can see, this is a factory built drag wagon. So Don, how do they end up making a factory drag wagon? It was built under contract by Chrysler. It was two wagons. It was this wagon and it was the ostrich wagon. This one was the four-speed wagon and the ostrich wagon was the automatic wagon. Wow. Pretty cool. There's no VIN tags on it or anything. Mm -hmm. Just factory mm -hmm. built. How long have you had it? About it seven years. Wow. Pretty exciting when you got this one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come right along. May I open it? Sure. Thank you. So you can see this is factory built drag car. There's your stick. There's your tack. Plain dash. All business. Now, do you have to do something interesting to start it? All these switches have to flip up? I mean... Yeah, this was kind of updated a little bit from than it would have been from the factory. Some of the switches in the electronics ignition and the shifter and all that's been upgraded. And I see this, this shift light in front of you. So do you still race it? I don't race it, no. Okay. How many wins did this thing have back in its day? Yeah. That I'm not, okay. I'm not sure about. I can, I can show you pictures of, the pictures of the books and stuff. Yeah, go ahead. Why don't you show me that? I'm going to take a look at the back while you grab those books. There's the wacky wagon, and just pulling it out, people are coming to check it out, and I completely get that. So I don't want to hold back enthusiasm, because, well, I'm pretty enthusiastic about seeing it. Factory built car. Yeah, go ahead, show me that. Let me get on this side. Keep, keep doing what you're doing. Yeah. So this was the first paint scheme on the car that Lee had on it. Wow. Lee also had a, a Barracuda or a Cuda, and he called it the Crazy Cuda. The Crazy Cuda. Yeah. And the Wacky Wagon. Is that him right there? Yeah, that's Lee Smith. Look at that with the different colors. When did it get this paint scheme? Oh, he's won something there big. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and he won the Nationals with this race. Wow. That trophy's still still around too. That's great, bigger than him. There it is with the front wheels off the ground. Wow. When did the second paint job come on it? The one that we see today? I'm gonna say probably closer to 1970 to okay. go along with the CUDA. And so this is the first paint job and then yeah. naturally they kind of change him up a little bit. There he is racing Ronnie Socks. This is at York US 30 Dragway. Sweet. Oh, that's great. Let me show the colors with the sun on it. Go ahead. Let's uh, let's shut this door. Come on with me. You'll see what I said that. If you could just close the hood for a moment. Look at that. Can you imagine that coming down the raceway? That is sweet. Very sweet. Well, I think the only thing we got left is uh, we need to fire it up. What do you think, Don? Sure. We'll fire it up. The Belvedere 1. Your 426 Hemi, not to be missed. 
The, what's the HP2 for, Don? That's for horsepower. Horsepower, got it. That, that is one amazing sound, isn't it? That's just great. Thanks. And special thanks to Fred Engelhardt for selling me the car. There you go. And I just want to say thanks so much for bringing the car out. Thanks for bringing it to Carlisle. Thanks for being on my car story. Thank you.